can find a virtuous woman for her price is far above rubies. She is blessed and praised. Hey, hey, Twister Girl. Welcome back to Twist and Shout. I am Char, and today I have to show you guys something new I've been working on. Unfortunately, it's not for sale. Why? Because I'm giving you this information for free. So, first of all, if you are new here, I love you. God bless you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Second, um, I have some good news. I have some bad news. <sighs> bad news first, right? That's what people always say. If you don't know, I sprung my ankle for the like 10th time in my life. My husband ordination is literally like in three weeks. <laughs> um, things are moving pretty fast, including church. So you remember that break I told you guys about? It might be indefinitely, meaning that I will no longer be selling any of my products. And you may say, that's not a reason, but like I said, school is really like that. I have to really be on top of my daughter. We must succeed. I have my own family issues. My car is a jerk. Like out of nowhere, I start having car issues. So I ask that you guys just be praying. I mean, if it be the Lord's will, pray for a miracle. But I have wrestled in my sleep. I have lost sleep. I have been praying. I shed tears. I am now content. So, whatever the Lord see fit, then that's what he see fits. His will be done. Y'all know I'm real big on putting God first. And it appears that God is growing the ministry faster and making that more productive than my business. And I'm okay with that. But anywho, it's nighttime. I don't know if you can tell the difference in the lighting, but... Um, I'm going to oil my hair with this. And as you can see, it's tinted, but this does not contain any powders at all. This is straight extra virgin organic olive oil and rosemary, lavender, thyme, and fennel. So, we're going to see how this feels like just on the scalp i literally made this with two ingredients i got from walmart like i said this was inspired by saying okay for people who can't i can't reach they can't reach me um in the event that something does go haywire with my business such as this then i want to be able to help you guys so all i'm gonna do is i got my hair in four sessions from yesterday's video all i'm gonna do is, is apply this on my scalp and we're gonna give a first impression and again, everything is organic and very inexpensive from Walmart. The herbs come in a seasoning jar like this big for four bucks. And that should last you for a long time because I barely tapped the surface to make this. And the organic extra virgin olive oil, I believe the cheapest is a $5 jar. So four and five equals nine for nine dollars you can have oil to last you about three months maybe so just um giving you some background information on this inspiration and why i made this and what's going on there's nothing wrong with my herbs and my oil at all as y'all can see it's just that it's more it's harder to come by those ingredients and things like you gotta look online and make sure they're organic you gotta wait to get them to see this is a way where in person you can see that these are actually organic but anywho, just going to split my hair open here. Always shake any oil up. And I do keep this in a dark, cool space because I, I don't have any more dark bottles. So, And this is a dark oil, obviously. And all I'm going to do is, is just go in and rub. Go in and rub. And you want to make sure you rub pretty quickly. You don't want anything to slide out. And I'm just going to go around my edges like so. And I did say I was going to wash my hair today, but then today happened and that didn't happen. Y'all know how that go. And now it's the weekend, so it's like 
Ciao. And this is my first impression. So if anybody want, if you're curious, you're a DIY person, by all means. But I'm just going to see if it caused any irritation. If it's, um, first things first, it smells nice. Like, it smells very pleasant. It doesn't smell earthly like the herb one. I mean, the um, powder one. Just going to come between the cracks here. It is very nice and smooth. I will say that. Very smooth. Very smooth oil. Very soft. All right, so that section is rubbed in. I'm just going to put my hair piece back on here. And I'm just so in love with how playful my curls is right now. Even though we're not talking about that. We're not talking about that, Char. But anywho, is there any other DIY people that watch my channel um, that has, like, a really basic form? Like I said, this is what... Olive oil, rosemary, thyme, fennel. It seems like, oh, and lavender. So five ingredients that you can read, that you can count, and that you can study and research what they do. And you know rosemary and lavender alone does wonders for your hair and scalp. So let's come down the middle here. And I am oiling at night because I did not want to be greasy and, you know, just in case I did actually leave the house. But, of course, I couldn't because I had a flat tire. So, you may notice that I didn't post anything about purchasing any products or anything today. And that is why. And you will see this video today. So, that's one good thing. We have internet now. So, record, post, record, post. But anyway, that's that section. And again, if y'all caught my video about these applicator bottles, they make things so much easier. Like, this is me just sitting on the floor minding my business, okay? And I'm oiling my scalp. Very quickly, may I add. And you get to put the amount you want. Um, it's a squeeze bottle. It's very soft. So, if you need a lot, like say if you was actually doing a pre-poo or a hot oil treatment to do on your ends. But with me, I'm just pressing gently because I'm putting this on my scalp. And go back here in this corner right quick. Ah, there you go. All right, so hair piece back on just to scratch it out a little bit. Nice. Over here. So, five ingredient oil. $9. That can last you for three months. So, I, I'm not trying to leave y'all high and dry. I plan on doing a breakdown of all my formulas. For anybody who wants to try them themselves. For those who aren't DIY people. I am so sorry. But the Lord will be done. Um... I'm pretty sure some of you are going to try and say, just make me some. And it's, I have to be, no. <laughs> I can't do that. Now, I would say, I have oil left. Like, I have a whole lot of oil. But my goal this whole time has been trying to get rid of what I have. So, the daily oil, I did have a backup stash being made of that. So, about 10 people get some of that. Um, the herbal oil, I have a lot. I have a lot. And that's because I have my backup, backup stash for myself. I have the one that was in brewing. And I had some left over. So, because each time I make a batch, I put me some to the side. So, that's why I have so much herbal oil, like a lot. Because my whole thing was, what if I go crippled? What if I lose my mind? Like, I want to make sure that I am covered and my children are covered, so. But this smells good. So far, no irritation. And honestly, I don't know why it smells so great. Like, it really smells really nice. It's kind of weird. I mean, I know rosemary doesn't stink, lavender doesn't stink, but those naturally don't, they smell okay, but they smell earthly. So, I don't know, y'all. I don't know what's going on with that. But, put my hair piece back on here. All right, so I'm done. 
any questions or concerns about this particular product, any of my products, please don't hesitate to ask. Please drop it down below. Again, I'm sorry for the inconvenience. I'm sorry for the... I love you guys. I will talk to you guys soon. God bless. Take care. Bye.